topping the news tonight. When the country's military members don't get to be at home for the holidays, it is common for people all across America to step up to create care packages. Local 3's Molly Hollabeek tops the news tonight by telling us about an effort underway right here in the UP. Westwood High School's BPA Club is focusing on helping our men and women in uniform this holiday season. They're about one week in on Operation Care Package, a collection drive that will be shipped to soldiers overseas. Our Business Professionals of America chapter here at Westwood has 41 students. And so in addition to those students, we, we kind of put it out there for our entire student body as well as our school community and the, and the surrounding community to try to see how much we could collect in order to uh, successfully participate in this drive. We're helping soldiers who aren't with their families during the holidays and they get to get the things that they don't normally get. Operation Care Package is asking the community to join their effort in donating things like non-perishable foods, hard candy, gum, personal hygiene products, soap, razors, card games, batteries, anything and everything you can imagine that would help our soldiers overseas. They're also accepting cash donations and students say that every little bit counts. It shows our group that each individual thing can bring us all together and help make a big difference. Like each little thing makes a big difference when it all adds up. And if you're feeling festive, they're also encouraging people to fill out a Christmas card or write a letter to show your appreciation to those who serve. We have, um, you know, a great appreciation for our military and for, for what they do for us and protecting our freedom. And we want to do what we can, our small part, in order to, to make their lives a little easier. Anyone interested in donating items or cash should drop them off here at the main office at Westwood High School by December 18th. Keeping it local in Ishpeming, I'm Molly Holabeek for Local 3 News.